Alright. Hello. Hope everyone is having a good day. Today we continue with Pokemon Mystery Dungeon with a special episode. We pretty much, I think uh, we are pretty much reaching the end of the first one. So we'll continue from there. Okay. <coughs> and yeah, that's pretty much what will be today. Playing through the special episodes, see what they are about, and stuff like that. <coughs> so yeah. Alright. Okay, doing some last checkups here and there, making sure that everything is in order here. Okay. Seems that everything is okay. There we go. No, okay. There we are. Okay. So let's let's go in already. Uh, special episodes. So yeah, Pidu's wish. We are pretty much there. We kinda died at the final boss, which is Jirachi. So we kinda have to do this whole thing again. Because I restarted. Because I died. So yeah, we kinda have to try again. Okay, that's a lot of stuff. Okay. We do have money. Rainy orb. Quick orb. Mm. Oh well. Okay, I remember the seed. Good. I'll take that. We are entering on hail again. Okay, must be here the stairs. Yep. Okay. Max elixir and an apple. Sure. Another reviver seed. Okay. <laughs> Man. Okay, you keep doing that. Thank you for the level up though. Okay. Uh, 
I just hope I can find the stairs quickly. Okay. You don't really need to do all that, but okay. A warp orb, okay. Yeah, here we are, back again. Hmm, this this looks like a dead end. This looks like the deepest part. And the depths of Star Cave. Where's Jirachi? <laughs> Who's there? Who's there? Okay, yeah, we remember this. Who is that? You're really so gullible to come trustingly all the way here. Huh? Who are you? Long time no see. <laughs> For me it's the second time. Again. Haven't seen you since we met at Treasure Town. Okay, yeah. You wish she was never here, so they say... Yeah. It was all a trick. We were scammed. We we believed it per first first hand without a second thought. We went through all the way here, and because they want our money. <laughs> yeah, that's remember. Never show the money out. <laughs> never put the money like out in the open. Who knows, maybe someone will see it. I'll take it. Okay. Prepare yourself. This is basically a losing fight. I can try whatever I want, but it won't work. And we got the revival seed. How many do we have actually? Because my yeah, we need to we need to waste the revival seeds, I guess. Okay. We can try to win. It can be possible. Because it can be possible, but it does is it's no problem if you also lose it because we lost <laughs> the first tra the first time. But this is also okay. It's too tough. Okay, yeah, too tough. You can do it alone. And suddenly, they are here. Yeah, hello. Well, the skill is here. Okay, let's do this again, and this time we'll win. For sure. Okay, yeah, sure. Alright, I can just go and grow. I won't need to lift fingers.
Okay. There we go. There goes one. Fisher didn't work. Sucker Punch, there it goes. And Glacar is out. Easy. Yep, they're strong, buddy. They are strong. Okay, yeah. Yeah, you're not good at lying, it turns out. You're not that good at lying, so they followed you. Yeah, there's a dead end, supposedly, but... There's a secret entrance, apparently. And it opens. Okay. Alright, let's go. Let's get in. But we'll have to go alone. This exploration must be done alone. And here they are talking how generous Willy Tap was, because co he could have wished for, for his favorite food, and instead he gave it to Bidoof. You have the chance to Bidoof. Ah, <laughs> that's how she didn't realize that and wants to go in right now. <laughs> okay, alright. Let's go ourselves. Alright. Revive our seed. The more better. Okay. This might take a little while. Confusion. Okay. Okay. There we go. And another. Sunny day. Okay. And another one. So many. And they are so tanky. Because I only have taco. So they take a lot of, ta of turns. But hey, they give a lot of EXP. So there's that. 
Okay, second floor. Yes. Okay. Alright. <clears throat> oh, another one. Okay, fourth floor. <laughs> we missed. Okay. There we go. Alright. So, five floors. Here it is, the deep. The deepest part. I've come pretty far. Holy, this here looks like da 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 da. Yeah. And there's Shivaji, like sleeping, half sleep or something. There he is! Shivaji! But he's still like asleep, or talking in, in his sleep. This is the best I can do. <laughs> just tag up on stuff, debuff, stuff like that. And just hope for the best. I have like a lot of trackers to use here. Okay, last one on bear for me. Okay, let's keep going. Confusion. That's a lot. And he fell asleep. Okay, we only have one reviver seed left. Come on. Damn it. Come on. We're done. No? Okay, one more turn. Nah, okay. We need to try this over again. Hmm. This is actually a lot harder <laughs> than, you s than it seems, apparently. Okay. Luminous orb. Okay. Okay, okay, come on. 
go. And another one. Level 11. Again. Okay. Here. Horanberry. We'll take it. Daughter Seed. We'll take that. Okay, Rain Yorp. Okay. Max Leaks here. Okay. Poison gas. Okay. Okay, or I'm very Okay, here they are. Stairs. Deep Star Cave. Okay. Let's try this again. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Same thing, same thing. Okay, we lost this time. I mean, it can be possible to win, but it comes to the same th is same outcome. Regardless, you win, you lose, same thing. Okay. And then we'll have skills arise right now. And we'll beat you entirely. We'll beat you to a pulp. Or until you decide to run away. Which is the latter. Okay. Okay.
And there goes one. And there goes bacon. And there goes Nova. Okay. Okay, yes. We already went through all of these already. Nothing here, you sure? Okay. Come on, wheel it off. Make the opening again. Okay, and there he goes. Alright. Okay, we start right next to Psyduck. Okay. Alright. Let's continue. Okay, let me see if I can find some items nearby, just in case. You never know. Or a shop. Blinker Seed. Mm. That's just nothing. Okay. There's a Lunaton. Okay. Okay, let me have a look around first, just in case. Hello. Pardon? <coughs> yeah. 
you're dead. So that didn't matter. Okay. <clears throat> All right. Berry will take it. All right, <coughs> we have to go with a daughter seed or a berry, and what else? I can't remember right now. Okay. Okay. So a bunch of foreign berries, iron thorn, and a torrent seed. And this, but I don't think it will do that much. Okay. Okay, you just stay far away. Sure, I'll take it. Ah, confusion. Okay. And swift. You have swift, damn it. Damn it. We need to have better items. We need better items. Okay. Okay, a daughter seed, we'll take that. Okay. Okay. Quick orb, ring orb, nothing. Maybe let's have a look around. Who knows, maybe find something good, maybe. Or maybe not. Okay, Psyduck, there you go.
Up gay. Nothing. All right. Let's continue again. Okay. Those are the stairs. Let's just see if we can find something decent. Okay, level 11, sure. Okay, warp orb. We can try that, I guess. That can be useful, maybe. Ow. Defense scarf, decoy orb. What does it do? Decoy. Okay, nothing useful then. The defense card though may come in may come in handy. Okay, there's nothing. So let's proceed. Okay, there we go. So many enemies. Okay, seeing this, I guess I have to heal. Because of this. Okay. Those are the stairs, but uh, let's see if we can find something decent in the items. Okay, an apple. Okay. All right. I must leap. Okay. Sunny day. Okay. Maybe something here? Maybe not. Yeah, maybe not. Okay. There it goes. Okay, so nothing here. Okay, there we go. Let's try this again. I guess we need to go like a somewhat thorough exploration on each floor to see if we can find something decent. We got at least a torch seat, so that's that. Oh 
Okay. Okay. Okay, there it goes, the failure. We were defeated. This one doesn't matter. The guild arrives. Okay. I wouldn't. No, don't need to even move at all. No, don't need it. Well, other than that. <laughs> okay, we could die here. Okay. All right, there we go. Okay, there we go. We could have almost died, but we did it. <laughs> we almost died from from that powder snow. Was it powder snow? The one that is like AOE? I I can remember. <laughs> Sorry. Okay, yeah, we're all here because you were acting suspicious and we followed you, yes. Okay. Okay.
Okay. Come on. Okay. 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 Let's go. By the way, how much? Okay. We could level up. Petrify orb. Okay. Are you the one with the sink paint? Perhaps. Maybe. Okay, you missed. Okay, you are the, s the one with the sing band. Special defense. That's probably what we need the most. I should probably, like, give it to Bidoof already. Okay. That's probably much better now. Okay. Okay, a rainy orb. An orange berry will take that. Okay. A max elixir, of course. Dead and heal. Okay. Special band. Max elixir. Nothing here. Okay. Guess we have to go one by one. You missed. Okay. Sunday, the weather didn't change. Okay, next. Okay. Come on. Level 12. Okay, we'll take that. Uh, nothing here. Okay. Third floor. The monster house. We enter right into the monster house. Why? Better if I enemies in the room. We can use that. I have no idea what items are there. Don't even want to pay it <laughs> to know what they are. Okay. Let's get out of here. We have al at least another floor to to check. Rainy orb. Not that helpful. Money. We'll take that. Okay. 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 
There goes one. Next is you. Okay, and there's nothing else. We'll take this, who knows. Okay. Let's just hope for the best. Okay, you know what, since this is probably the better one so far... Hold on... I'm going to try... Okay... Alright, save there... Okay. Okay. Let's try this properly. Let's start with the defense scroll. We'll throw the torture seed. We'll use the quick orb. We can use it, never mind. Okay. Damn, that's a lot. Jeez. Confusion. Too tough, I'll have to try again. Yeah, here we are again. And if we can. Uh, it doesn't seem that we lose items. It seems. Well, 
We did lose some items. Never mind. Because we, you know what? Let's try this like this. We have a sink bench. Let's try it like this. No case, the orbs won't help. They're completely ineffective. Okay. Cricket dot and now a bonsai. Come on. Come on. Okay. Gold pin and another John and poison gas. Okay. the stairs. There we go. All right. Oh, <coughs> okay. Okay, say that with a reviver seed, I want that. I want that reviver seed. Okay, golden. And another jump, of course. Okay. There we are. Psyduck. With the revival seat. Okay, anything here that can be useful doesn't seem like it. Okay. I'm getting closer to leveling up again, at least. So who knows, maybe we'll be able to learn a better move. <laughs> Come on. Damn it. We lost the survivor seat, damn it. So many enemies here. Anybody else that doesn't like it? Okay. Alright. I 
Okay, those are the stairs, so let's keep looking around. Okay. Poison gas. Okay, 13. Roll out. Okay, roll out. Let's go and take the stairs already. Power band? Okay. Hmm. Come on. Fourth floor. Okay, let me have a look around. We'll have to go with this now. All right, let's try like this. Star gave deaths. Okay, so we ba we basically have to go through like the two sections entirely. Okay, set up with a revival seat. We need that. I want that. No oh well. Come on. Okay, want to find the side that could be you? No. There's another side that wandering around. Well then. Okay, where are you? Who is the Pokemon with the Reviver Seed? Is it you? There you are. 
Okay. Let's proceed. Okay, let's have a look around. Come on. We got confused. Okay, you know what? I just want to leave. Maybe not. We missed. Where do you know? Go figure. Ah, Lunaton. Yes, let me leave. Please. And a goblin. Come on. Need to go. Already another explosion here. More than enough. Just let me leave. No, they won't let me leave. Come on. There we go. So many rainy orbs. Jeez. Okay. And we keep on missing. <laughs> well then, guess we have to go with the last echo. And I fell asleep. Yeah, no, I'm living. Screw you. I'm living. Uh, 
Okay. Let's give this a try then. Hey, Rachi, I've come back. Yep, yep. Ah, oh, how sleepy. So sleepy that you basically entering combat. Not you, Rachi, yes. I'm be doof. That's what I've been telling you since the beginning. You're still so sleepy. I tend to act strangely when I sleep and cause trouble all around me. So I apologize again. <sighs> I thought this before, yep, yep. He isn't really as sleepy, is he? You ready? <sighs> ready. Will Roller work? I have no idea. You just steal a lot of damage, jeez. Well, we... Mm, two attacks seems to be the maximum for me. Confusion. And uh, we got confused. And we died, okay, and we revived. So we try this again. Come on. And we missed. And we missed. Honestly. Okay, there we go. Oh, well, what's going on? Huh, all right, I am fully awake. So, so awake. Ah. My name is Yurachi. Um, who are you? I am Bidoof. Golly, how many times do I need to tell him? Your name is Pidoof. So Pidoof. You better listen well. I grant wishes for those who manage to wake me up. All of a sudden. I'm not ready for this yet. Ahem. Alright. I listen. What is your wish, Pidoof? My wish. My wish is... Um... Um... Okay, we, <laughs> we have a lot of options. To become rich, to be the strongest Pokemon, to be the best explorer, to eat lots of yummy food, to sleep well, to get lots of items, to rule the world. <laughs> the last one is a <laughs> the last one sounds so hilarious to use. <laughs> I'm going to use that one, sure. To rule the world, if this is really what you want. Yeah, sure. And you're absolutely sure this is what you want. Yes. <laughs> to rule the world. That's really a nice wish and all, but but my dream. Huh? Something wrong? What's your wish, Bidoof? Something wrong? You don't have a wish? My dream is to become the best explorer ever. Yep, yep. The best explorer. Got it. That's pretty easy. Okay, here we go. Oh, wait. A moment, wait a moment, please. Uh huh. What is it? Golly, well, my dream is to become the best explorer ever, that's true. 
But at first I thought I had come down here and asked you for that, yup yup. But I'm giving up on that plan. Truly? Why? Because because I've come to see it's not something you can wish for, by golly. You've got to work hard. Once you've really done your best, put in the effort, then you can feel like a worth explorer. You could have had lots of experiences, lots of feelings and memories. Those are the ways you learn, grow and get better, little by little. Yep, yep. Yes, sir. I got a lot clearer on all this stuff during this adventure. So my wish to be the best explorer ever? Hirachi, I'm not asking you for that anymore. I see. Well spoken. So you don't have any wishes? What you just said. It shows something about you. Not everyone can resist being greedy. You're a good Pokemon, Bidoof. I've come to like you. So if you don't have a wish right now... Oh, wait. Just a moment, please. Yep, yep. What is it? You just said a nice thing about me not being greedy, Jirachi. So maybe I shouldn't ask. It's alright. Go ahead. If... If you still grant me a wish... I wish... I wish... I wish for a buddy who I could do stuff to. A buddy? You are training at the guild, aren't you, Bidoof? So you want a buddy, Bidoof? Someone you can show around and give a helping hand to? That's right. During this adventure I... Golly, thanks to the guild master and everyone in the guild caring about me. I feel so incredibly happy, yep. But... I don't want to get used to it and start acting spoiled or anything. That's why... That's the reason I like a ball or two. If I had a buddy, a ball, I could share what I learned with that get better and better as I push forward. Know what I mean? Yes, got it. Your wish, Bidoof? I will make it come true. Really? Yep. Maybe it won't be soon, but sooner or later you'll see some new faces at the guild. You should look forward to it. Thank you, Chirachi. Thank you so much. Okay, it took us like an hour and 30 minutes. And so... And so my exploration of Star Cave came to an end. Yep, yep. And now... Huh? Your eyes look a bit puffy. What's wrong? Gonna sleep? My eyes too? I see. We're pretty busy every day with assignments, aren't we? <laughs> we just entered the guild and there's still so much we don't know, but... Let's keep at it. Really? There really is a new apprentice. And not only that. There are two of them. Chirachi, thank you so much. Yep, yep. As your older buddy, I won't let you down. I'm going to work hard at my guild training each and every day. Okay. <laughs> Staff credits. Okay. Well, this goes. I'll just take. I will take this advantage to take a break and uh, grab something to eat and stuff. It will be about time. And do the little tune in the meantime. Be right back in a couple of minutes, okay?
All right. <coughs> uh, we're back. All right. Hold on. <coughs> okay. There we go. All right. All righty. <coughs> and the items obtained, blah blah blah, blah. okay. Alright, there goes one chapter. And we got a little star, okay. Let's go to the next. Eclip of the Prodigy. <coughs> Alright, it's night time. We are asleep. Everyone is asleep. Louder snoring. Kill Master, it's a thought. <coughs> I'm coming in. Sorry to have kept you waiting. Here's your perfect apple. Yay! Thank you! <laughs> this is the last time. Each night I sneak away from here when I bring your perfect apple from storage. I'm fed up with it. Please let me stop doing this. I'm begging. That is the guild master. Was sneaky and I need one anyway, if I didn't bring him one. Oh! Is this a different globe? It's alright. It's not damaged. That's good. I thought it could cheat or broken when I dropped it. That's kind of a rare item for you, guild master. You're usually pretty rough with items, guild master. But it's nice to see the reason I don't let you take good care of. Kill Master is always taking care of perfect apples. That is, he's like that again today. That is, it seems like that defend globe is a very precious exclu exclusive item, isn't it? But this item only has an effect on back type Pokemon. So even though you are holding on to it, Kill Master is not very useful, is it? Yes. I know you're right, but but this is a special thing. Special thing. Yep, a special thing. It's why when I decided to become an explorer, the starting point. A special episode two, Eclipse of the Prodigy. Way back when. Yep. That was back when I was still a small child. It, I was an Eclipuff yet. This was back when I was still an Eclipuff. There everyone lived an easy life. It was a very peaceful prairie. I was raised in that little house. I lived happily there with my parents. Good morning, Iglybuff. Yep, good morning, Papa, Mama. Hey, Iglybuff. You've got plans to play with your friends today, right? I bought a bunch of gummies. Take some to share. Yep, thanks, Mama. Iglybuff received many gummies from Mama. Iglybuff. Iglybuff, let's play. Look, your friends are here. Be careful. Come home before it's dark. Yep, I'm off. The special episode for Iglybuff the Prodigy stars Iglybuff as the main character. <coughs> yeah. Okay, Iglybuff is bad. Top one on the left. Okay. And we have nothing. Let's see from here. Okay, summary. Level 17. Lot of attack. 
low on special attack and defense though. From the cute charm, mix an attacker of the opposite gender who has a direct attack infatuated. Okay, and moves, sing, pound, sweet case, and copycat. Okay. Let's go. This music in specific, it, it brings so much nostalgia. Nostalgia. From, because this is from, straight from the first game. Oh, wake the buff. Hey everyone! Yay, yeah, let's go, let's go! Hey, what should we play today? Let's play in the mud! Yuck, I don't want to! Isn't a lady like to get all muddy? Smooch! I brought some gummies, would you guys like one? Yay! I want one! I love gummies so, so much! Yay, I love gummies! Thanks, silly buff! Yay, gummies! How are they? Great! Delicious! Thank you! Gummies are tasty! You are the best, silly buff! <laughs> I'm happy to... Friendly friend! Hey, you guys! You guys! What are you doing there? Bonnet? And Scroopy. Them? The bullies. Vanetta and Scroopy. Oh. Hey, Iglybuff. You've got gummies? Give us some gummies too. Lots. Bunches. Heaps of them. Yep, sure. Friendly friends. Why is Iglybuff making friends with those bullies? I sometimes play with Banette's group, but they always boss me around. And if you close them, they're really mean. Maybe Glibo isn't scared of those two. Gums are so delicious. It's kind of weird that these guys in the slightest bit scared of us. Yeah, they're so gum they're so yummy. But it's fine as long as we can boss him around. <laughs> hey, give give me another gummy. Me too. Yep. Huh? I'm all out of gummies. I got so many of them too. I wonder what happened. Sorry. It's alright. Well, I mean, we ate up all of them. Didn't he notice? It's alright. We'll forgive you. Just bring more gummies next time. Yep, friendly friends. So naive. Ah, uh, doesn't Inglibus realize he's being played by Banette? I hate that. I won't forgive this. You shouldn't get involved. They're really big and scary. Mm. Hey, everyone. We should go talk to Iglyph's mama. She'll know what to do. Yeah. Yeah. <coughs> Sleep now, sweet little child. You're truly adorable. Sleep now, sweet little child. And asleep. Alright, he's sleeping. Hey, Papa. I've been worried about something. What is it? I heard from Iglybuff's friends today. Iglybuff is being manipulated by some bullies. Some bullies? Yeah. Iglybuff's friends came to talk to me about it. Hey. You don't think he'd become like them, do you? Sometimes I really have no clue what that child is thinking. So I'm a little worried. Yeah, that does seem troublesome. But, but I think it's alright. Eclipus is still so cheerful. No matter how he may seem, deep down he has a good heart. Besides, didn't we have this, didn't we have this discussion before? Back when I climbed that mountain with Eclipus on our way home. When Iglybuff and, and I returned from climbing the mountain, we found ourselves stuck in a sudden storm. So scary. 
me. Are you alright, Igly Buff? Yeah. Can you feel that? Their stomach's causing the ground to shake. We need to get off this mountain quickly. It's too dangerous to be here. Let's hurry. Yeah. Ah! Eagle buff! And right then, this huge boulder started to fall right above me. Oh! Papa! It's not good. I'm going to be crushed. And just when I thought that. The hell was that? Somehow, the boulder was mashed to pieces. I wasn't crushed by the boulder. Somehow I was saved. I'm not sure what happened, and I still don't exactly know what it was. But I'm sure that it was Eclipse that saved me. Of that, I am certain. That kid has some kind of mysterious power. He doesn't just have some strong power. When people are in trouble, that's when it appears. I get the feeling this power is full of this kindness for others. I understand your concerns, but I think we should trust our child a little more, okay? Yes, you're right. I'm sorry. He'll be okay. After all, he is our son. Yeah, it's a good thing to be concerned about. So, don't worry. That is, the fact that you are concerned, and it just shows how much you truly care about Iglybuff, right? Yeah, thank you. Okay, interesting. The next morning... Good morning, Papa, Mama. Good morning. Okay, now what? Be careful, okay? Come home before it gets dark. Yep, got it, Mama. Are you headed out with friends again today? Yep. Okay. Okay, I'm off. See you later. Take care. Huh? You want to play explorers? Yeah, let's play explorers. We want to become an expansion team in the future. So we should go out and explore unknown areas. What do you think? It's great, right? So, this unknown place, where are we going? Hmm, that's a good question. You'd make a good apprentice explorer, buddy. We decided on a place. Murky Forest. What? M murky Forest? Is that what you said? Smooches? No way, I don't want to. Going to the forest is not allowed at all. My mommy even said so. There's even a rumor that a big scary monster lives in the forest. Why do you want to go there? Doesn't it seem like the type of place that special teams would go? Don't tell me. Does that mean that you're scared to go? No. I'm not scared. It's just that you shouldn't go places you've been told not to go. I don't... I don't like it. I'm not going. Me neither. I'm staying out of it. Same here. And Igli was this? What's this? They're all a bunch of cowards. They're scared of making up all these lame excuses. It's pathetic. I doubt they'll ever be a real exploration team when they grow up. Not at all likely. Hey, what's an exploration team? What? You don't know what an exploration team is? Nope. But you're still here, so that means... That means you've got the courage? Yep, I do. Alright, you'll do. Come along. Yay, thanks, friends. Alright, everyone line up. Alright, from now on, we're an exploration team headed for Murky Forest. Gather up your courage and let's go. Yeah. Yeah. Yay, yay. <laughs> okay. Murky Forest. 
Okay. So... And we have any items, okay. Okay, that's a lot of damage. There we go. An uproar. Okay, proceed. Murky forest. Sing band. Okay. You do so much damage, jeez. Okay. <laughs> we missed. Okay. Okay. Feet floor. Alright, a petra scarf. That can be helpful. Maybe. Okay. Sixth floor. Okay. All right, seventh floor. We're getting closer. I guess. I think. Maybe. No idea. Okay, yeah. B we've come pretty far. It's a really dark place, this is. Oh. Huh? What's wrong, Scrooby? But. This is that place that everyone says you're not supposed to go. The. The depths of this forest. And the rumor that there's a terrible monster living in here. What is it? Are you suddenly afraid now that we're here? I've got no sympathy. If you say that... If you say that... You... You're making me start to feel scared. <laughs> but then you're the ghost Pokemon. You're supposed to scare people. <laughs> not, not getting scared. Oh well. Hmm, scary. There's something here though. Don't, don't say that you, you coward. What is it? Now that you say it, Banette, you're really scared, aren't you? 
scared me? What nonsense. Don't pretend to be tough. Even while you're talking, I can see tears welling up in your eyes. <laughs> no, that's not true. That's just not true. I'll show you I'm not scared. Hey, hey, you terrible monster. Can you hear me? What? I'm the Great Banet. I'm an explorer. We've come to beat you. So quit hiding and come on out. It's not coming out. What's this? Not here. I knew it. I knew it all along, from the start. I knew that it was just a simple rumor, nothing more. There was no monster here. There never was one. <laughs> Is that so? <laughs> okay. Alright. I guess this exploration is done. Anyone, let's go home. Yeah. Yeah. What's that? Did you just hear something? Some... I think I hear some kind of growl. Hey, you over there. Didn't you say you're an exploration team? Ah. Uh, Get out of here! Coming in here! I don't know who in the world you think you are. Ah! He is here! What's this? A bunch of kids? Huh? Weren't there more of you? You too, Junior? You better run away quick! If you stay here, something bad will happen. Hey, mister! What are you doing here, mister? And then, aren't you scared? And then just scared of me? Nope, not scared. So, what are you doing here anyway, mister? He... He's a strange little fellow. Hey, tell me. Tell, tell. I told you to go home. If you answer me, I'll go home. Answer, answer. No way. Go home. A sure answer is fine. Really fine. Ugh. You're persistent. I guess I've got no choice. I'll tell you a little. Come with me. Yay! Oh, there's an opening in the rock here, deep in the forest. Where are we going in? Wow, amazing! Secret base, secret base! Not quite. It's not a secret base, it's just my home. My name is Armaldo. I used to be an explorer. But not anymore, because of one thing. I've taken a break from Explorer. And so I spent my days here. So, what's exploring? Huh? You don't know about exploring? Exploring is so much fun. It's incredibly exciting. So much fun. Incredibly exciting? That's right. Distant lands, uncharted territory. You've seen many remarkable places. And solve the mysteries you find there. Really? And you get to bring back treasure and fortune with you. Oh? That's so cool! And you have to keep at it, working hard and overcoming difficulties, until you finally achieve your dreams. For example... For example, the secret map. Armal the honey grip of the secret map. Open it up and have a look. This seems to be a map that indicates the location of some treasure. Study it closely. It doesn't really make sense, does it? If I don't figure out the cipher, then I'll never be able to uncover the location of the treasure. But you're just a kid, you wouldn't know anything about this. 
I've been working on this one for a long time, but haven't been able to figure it out yet. However, I'm not giving up. I can't. I know that if I can overcome this challenge, there will be a future. In leap of the hell that you're doing. <laughs> That's the adventure exploration. It's thrill, it's essence, it's never ending attraction. Hey! <laughs> burn it, burn it! Hey, Junior! What are you doing? Knock it off! Hot, 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 hot. <laughs> so hot! Water, water! Oh, yeah, water gun! <sighs> oh, my, my precious secret map! It's... it's charred! Look! What? I don't need the charred parts. You can see something. If you press away the charred parts, can you see anything special? Igliba press away the charred parts of the map. What? Right here. Isn't there something written here? Right, written. Eastern cave. Eastern cave. Really? Is it true there's treasure there? Yep, yeah, I knew it. <laughs> that is... How did you know? <coughs> how did you figure out this map's secret? When I looked at the map, I saw it was really thick. So I figured that there must be le two layers to it. But I didn't think there was any other way to build off the top layer. So I thought I'd burn it off. This kid. I've been working on that puzzle for so long, and he solved it, just like that. That is this kid, just like that. Hey, if you go to this Esther cave, will you find treasure there? Please take me with you. I want to go and see. But I'm... I'm a retired explorer. I can't just jump back in. Huh? But don't you like explorer? Exploring? I mean, earlier you sounded like you really enjoyed talking about it. And you're working so hard on the secret of that map. If you don't go, it will be a waste. That's... It's true that it will be a waste not to go after solving the map's riddle. But I'm hesitant to leave here. Maybe I wouldn't attract too much attention with a little tree twister cave. Alright. Hey, Junior. You made a good point. We'll go. Really? Yes, really. But it's a little too late to start today. Your mom and dad are probably worried. Today you should go on home. Tomorrow we'll head out. Yep. Thank you. Alright, let's do our best tomorrow. Yeah. The next morning. Good morning, Papa. Good morning, Mama. Yep, good morning. Good morning, Igliba. Okay. We'll give this to you. And just in case, let's see here. Okay. Where will you go? Let's go to Armaldo's shelter. Okay, I'm off. See you later. Take care. Oh, Iglybuff. Iglybuff, I heard that you went out swimming with the bullies. Was it alright? Yeah, it was fine. Everyone went home in the middle of it. Smooches, that's good. We're worried about you. Hey, Iglybuff. Let's play together today. Hmm, sorry. I already got plans for today. Plans? Where are you going? Murky Forest. What? Murky Forest? Yep. See you later. Hey, Igluebuff. Were you okay after that? Yep. I can't believe you got away. I thought maybe you got eaten by that monster. What monster? I don't know what you're talking about. I made a friend. Friend? Yep, a friend. I headed out to play with my friend again today. See you! Okay. Armaldo's shelter. 
Good morning. Hey, here you are, Junior. Quick, let's go, let's go. No need to be impatient. If you're exploring, you have to make sure you're well prepared. Prepared? Yes. Look at this. What? What's this? This is called a Gangascan Rock. Here you can make a record of your adventure and sort your items. It's so that you shouldn't pass up on your explorations. Really? Oh, hey! Stop hitting it like that! Anyhow, you can go ahead and use any items you find at the Gangascan Rock as you see fit. So let's use the Gangascan Rock to finish preparations for adventure. Yep, got it. Okay, and we save again. Okay. Did you finish getting ready? Yes. Yep. Alright. Alright. Let's go. We're looking for the treasure in Eastern Cave. Got it, Junior? You're just a beginner when it comes to exploring. Don't be so impertinent and don't hold me back. Yep. Okay, Ninkaras. Okay. Blinko seed. Mm. Okay, more blinker seeds. Okay, fifth floor. Seventh floor. Okay, more money. Okay. Another dead end here.
Okay. So much. And dealing a lot of damage. Okay. We've come pretty far. A treasure. I wonder where it is. Oh, can you see that light over there? Let's go check it out. Whoa, amazing! What? What's this? So many traps, it is. Whoa! This is so amazing! There's a door in the front here. I think the treasure passed that door, don't you? Harry, let's go, let's go! Wait, Junior! What? Didn't you notice the design of this room? Look carefully! There's some kind of trick to it. Trick? Yes. I'm pretty sure that there will be a treasure behind that door, but... The trouble is, we need to figure out how to open that door. Look above the door. You see the symbol that kind of looks like an eye? I think if we put some kind of rug or something in there, something will probably happen. But, there's two giant locks on both sides. And all these little openings in the floor have caught my, my attention. That pillar over there, and I will switch along the groove. We move the pillar along the track on top of the, flo uh, the switch on the floor, something's gonna happen. This is a very common layout. This kind of trap is usually easy to identify. And these packs here on the wall, look at them. They definitely caught my attention. And what's this crystal here? If you hit this crystal, something's gonna happen. The crystal's color will probably change and something will come up from the floor or something. I think that's how it works. And this, it looks like, a co like this contraption is important somehow. It's pretty suspicious to find such a puzzling thing in a place like this. The more I think about it, the more it seems like someone has gone to an awful lot of trouble to keep people out. It takes a trained eye to spy out all these ingenious devices. I see. So we should go around and try everything. No! That might prevent the door from ever opening. There are traps too. Is that so? I see. Anyway, this room is full of dangers. We really need to proceed with caution here. Yep, got it. Yay! What? And it does that. <laughs> I did it! I opened it! You just broke through the door. You just broke the door. What the? Hurry! Let's go! What in the world is this kid? Hey, hurry! Got it. Jeez. Would you like to save? Yeah, sure. What a kid. Save completed. Oh! There's a treasure chest over here. Over there. Hey, open it and see. Hurry, hurry! Armaldo opens the treasure chest. Inside was the Defend Globe. This is... Wow! So cool! What is this? This is a Defend Globe. A Defend Globe? Yay yeah, yay! Yeah. Oh! It's very valuable. It's a very hard to find item. It's an exclusive item for back type Pokemon. Hey! Aren't you listening to what I'm saying? It's alright, I heard you. I don't really understand. But it's really cool. We did it. <laughs> Just a little kid enjoying an adventure. What is this? He's so happy. He doesn't even know the value of this item, but he's just so ridiculously happy. We did it. We did it. Yay. Hmm. He showed a powerful intuition in getting that door open earlier. This kid is... This kid, I don't really get his personality. He radiates an unknown and quality. And guessing 
This kid has an, ama an amazing natural talent or something. For explorers, this is an unbelievable advantage. Hey, this play is so much fun. I had no idea. Oh yeah. Master. Master. Me? Yep, that's right. The exploration master. Master, I have a request. Please? Please take me on as your apprentice. M my apprentice? No, I'll pass. I don't really see myself taking care of someone else as an apprentice. And besides, I quit exploring. It's too late for me to do anything like that. But, did you came out on this exploration, didn't you? You did, didn't you, master? Uh, this is the first time I've had so much fun. It's like I've changed somehow. I want to keep exploring. That is, I like to keep exploring. Please, take me on as your apprentice, master. Master, please. Mm, wow, he's even kneeling on the floor. He's sure intent on this request. However, he's so round. It's hard to tell if he's really kneeling on the floor or not. <laughs> what should I do? It would be extremely risky if I were to start exploring as part of a team again. But this kid has so much potential, it's amazing. I'd love to see just how far this kid could go as an explorer. Being together is a little annoying, but I have another feeling as well. It's really got my attention. I think I could start exploring again. As long as it has as long as it was with him. Alright. I've got it. You can be my apprentice. Really? But my training is very strict. If you won't go along with me, then we're through. Yay! I did it, thank you. <laughs> and so Master recognized me as his apprentice. And he returned to being an explorer. And so Master and I went out on explorations together. <laughs> I'm looking forward to you taking care of me, Master. Taking care of you. Hey, wait. The way you're acting, I don't know if we'll be doing anything together. Don't be so extreme, Master. How are we going to be an exploration team if you start off acting like that? Hey! I'm so happy! <laughs> okay. I've had so much fun since Master took me on as an apprentice. Okay, I'm off. See you! Take care! I will head off to Master's house soon after I got up every morning. We would open up the map and look for a place to explore. Hey Master, let's explore this place today. This place level the end of the world. Come on, there's no way we could go to such a place. We decided where to go together like two old friends. And then head out exploring right away. Wow, treasure, treasure! Don't be so happy-go-lucky. There might be a trap. Ah! Master! 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 <laughs> it's alright. I can rescue him later. <laughs> Master and I made a great team and we found a bunch of treasure. Just like that, we went on one successful exploration after another. Then, a few months later... Damn! Wow, amazing! There's so much treasure, Master! Alright, let's take it all back with us. Alright! It's really something, this kid. We've been exploring together for a while. I've never seen anyone with a natural sense for exploring like he has. I'm sure... I'm sure that this kid is some kind of exploration prodigy. <coughs> Master, what are you doing? Hurry, hurry! Yeah, I'm on my way.
We found a lot today, didn't we? <laughs> success, success! Hey, master! Where are we going to explore tomorrow? What? We just finished today's exploration and already you're talking about tomorrow's? You're getting a little ahead of yourself. That's it. I bet that tomorrow's location will be even better to us than today's. Really? Yes. Tomorrow we're going to Fortune Ravine. Rumor has it that there's a lot of treasure there. Amazing. I can't wait. Let's go tomorrow. Definitely. Yeah. Will you be alright getting home from here by yourself? Yep, I'm fine. Alright, see you at my place tomorrow. And then we'll head out for Fortune Ravine. Yep. Bye bye, Master. See you tomorrow. Huh, <sighs> same as ever. He's always so cheerful. Cheerful is good, but. He's so cheerful that he tires me right out. I should go home. I'm exhausted. But I have to admit, cheerfulness is kind of contagious. Hmm? That Pokemon. That Pokemon was that? The next morning. Good morning, Papa, Mama. Yep, good morning. Good morning, Nigglypuff. <coughs> okay. Where will you go? Armando's shelter. Okay, I'm off. See you later. Take care. Alright. Good morning, Master. Oh, hi, Junior. Before you got here, I was doing some research on Fortune Ravine. It's a lot harder than any of the dungeons we've visited so far. You know, with my strength, it will probably be difficult. Huh? So we're not going? Maybe, maybe not. I'm concerned about what to do. Let's go. It will be fine, I know. Together, Master and I are invincible. It's alright, alright. That's right. Now, thanks to me. This kid is an inspiration prodigy. If I tried to go alone, I couldn't do it. But if he's with me... No, alright. I agree. Let's go. To Fortune Ravine. Master! I knew we were going to go. That's my master. Take care of your exploration preparations so the Gangas can rock. Once you're ready, we'll go. Alright. Well, go like this. Huh? Junior, did you finish getting ready? Yep. Yep. Alright. Okay, let's go. To Fortune Ravine. Yep. Just then. At Iglipa's house on the prairie. Eagly buff, let's play. Oh, it's Mochum and everyone. Oh, it's Eagly Buff's mama. I'm sorry, Eagly Buff isn't here today either. He always is inviting him to join you. It's not very nice of him to always be too busy. By the way, Eagly Buff's mama, what is it, Mochum? Is it true that Eagly Buff goes to play in Murky Forest every day? What? In Murky Forest? Is that true, Osmochum? We don't really know. But that's what we heard. It looks like his mama doesn't know either. If it's true, I wonder if Igrip was okay. Going to that place to play all the time. Hey, Banette. Hey, Banette. Have you seen Igripuff? Igripuff? Oh, isn't Igripuff still going to Murky Forest? What? We've seen him go in there several times. To be going to that scary place. Honestly, I don't really get him. Inglipuff, I mean. No, oh, I just saw him a little while ago. 
the scary looking guy deep in the forest. Igliba seems to have made friends with him or something. What? I wonder if he's alright. Been with that scary guy, I mean. Papa? Can I talk to you for a moment? Your conversation. Can you tell me a bit more about it, please? Hey, you. Me? That part where you said there's a scary looking guy living deep in the forest. What's he look like? He looks like he's got big claws and a shield that looks like armor. I don't know, but he just looks really scary, you know? I'll bet it's him. It's gotta be. Um, who are you? My apologies for not introducing myself. I am Nido King. I'm an explorer. An explorer? Yes. <coughs> I should introduce myself properly. The truth is I am. What? Really? We've got a problem. Well then. Meanwhile, we're going to the ravine. Okay. <laughs> there we go. We just did a lot of damage. Level 18. Went up by 5. Attack went up by 3. Defense by 3. Special attack by 3. Special defense by 3. Jeez. You take a lot of stats yourself. Okay. Okay, there we go. Let's pick up the money. Alright, third floor. And fourth floor. Okay. There we go. Well, let's go here. At the stocks. Okay, more EXP. I'm just one shot in everything. And I'm the and I'm a baby Pokemon. <laughs> yeah, lower my evasion, it won't it won't help you. Okay, that's just more money. Okay. Okay. Fifth floor. Let's go. Okay, you missed. There we go. Ah, 
Okay. Reviver seed, okay, we'll take that. And an apple. Okay, six floor. Okay, you have a lot of HP. <coughs> and you drop a lot of EXP. Okay, seventh floor. Luminous orb. Eighth floor. We just gained a lot of EXP. Hold on. How much left? Nah, okay. Okay, we're reaching the halfway point here. Master, what is this? This is a danger, uh, dungeon waypoint. It connects to the depths of Fortune Ravine. It's a waypoint area. I see. So we'll be in the depths soon then. That's right. I'm sure of it. When we're on the subject of waypoints and dungeons, finding a waypoint usually means that something awaits you at the end. Something awaits. Like what? For example, the boss of this dungeon. Boss? Yes, that's right. If there's a boss in the dungeon, try it carefully. They might misunderstand what you're doing here and wonder whether you're trying to take over the territory. They really won't listen to what you're saying. You're likely to be attacked often. Hmm, seems like dungeon bosses don't have much patience. I don't know whether or not they have patience. Anyway. <coughs> Uh, we need to brace ourselves for what we'll find from here on. Yes, master. Happy, happy. Alright, let's continue. Fortune Ravine Depths Okay, nice leaf Okay Okay Okay. <laughs> a lot of enemies in a row. Uh, okay. Let's continue. Second floor. Okay. Okay, nothing here. 
Oh, sorry. All right. There it is. Nothing here. A bellosome. Okay. Okay. More stairs, fourth floor. Fifth floor. Okay, level 19. 5, 4, 3, 3, 3, and 3. Okay. 6th floor. Well, dang. Okay, I'll handle this one. Okay. go okay for the ravine pit this is this seems to be the deepest part of the dungeon make sure you're prepared you don't know what awaits your head oh there's a door over there Torches are burning all around. Master, is there some kind of trick to opening the door here too? You've really learned a lot, Junior. That's right. These torches must provide the solution to the puzzle of opening the door. Furthermore, this is a very common type of puzzle. What should we do? It's simple. If we blow out all the torches, the door will open. Watch. Here goes. Water gun. Alright, the door should open now. Huh? Master, the door isn't opening. Why? Why not? Whoa! Ow, 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 ow. My back hurts. Master, are you okay? Yeah. How are you, Junior? I'm okay. Oh, for pity's sake. We seem to have fallen into a pit. Pit. Is that what this is? This whole... Hey, master. What is it? Those torches. It's just like they wanted to open the door. Truth is, they were there to open the pit. It was some kind of trap. Trap? But if this really is a trap, it's so dark I can't see a thing. Truth is, we seem to have landed ourselves in a difficult position. Oh. 
Hey, I can hear something. Is it that there's something getting closer? You... Why can't you stay so calm? I'm not calm. I'm incredibly excited. Oh dang. It's a monster house. They're here. Let's do our best, master. Don't we always? Don't never let yourself be caught and prepared, Junior. And a hail. Okay. Okay, there goes one. Objective, survive. Okay, there goes Mega. And there goes Clayro. Okay. There we go. Okay, first try. Oh, we just barely beat them. I can see some kind of light over there. Let's go check it out. Master, this is outside. It looks like once you leave the ravine, it connects to this place. Among the rocks and stones, I can see some crumbled pillars and what looks like a stone wall. Don't tell me that this is... Oh, Master! Look over there. I can see some kind of ruins off in the distance. I knew what this is. An ancient city that's been buried by time, I believe. Hey, Master. But there's a bunch of treasure over there. Hurry, let's go. So excited. Oh. Wait. I finally found you, Armaldo. My name is Nido King. I'm an explorer. What? What did you say? Oh. Papa, Mama, and everyone. Are uh, you alright, Iglybuff? You're not hurt? I'm fine, Mama. Why? Friends, friends, what's with everyone? Iglybuff, listen carefully. Over there, the Pokemon next to you, Iglybuff, is an outlaw. What? An outlaw? A bad guy. That's what the Pokemon is. Master is a bad guy? That's right. This guy, Armaldo. It's a Pokemon we've been chasing for a while. In order to catch Armaldo, I came here. Nidokin is telling the truth. Armaldo is a B rank outlaw. We've been searching the entire region for him. As soon as we heard from Nidokin, we came running. That. So? Let the kid go, Armaldo. It's a lie. It can't be true. Kid, it's alright. To drag a kid into this, you're the lowest. No, I asked him, and 
Master is in a bad Pokemon. Alright, let's finish this. Stop! Please, listen to me. Hurry up, move it. Mm. Oh, well, what? What is this? Oh. The, the ground. Is it shaking? Oh. Oh, no. Wait. Stop it, Junior. Huh? I'm asking you. Stop, please. Master. If you blast Nidokin and Magnezone, you'll become a bad guy too. And then what will you do? So please stop now. But Master is in a bar Pokemon. I've been with you this long, I know that. Oh, Sir Magnuson? Yes? Could you give me a minute? It's alright. I won't try to run. Understood. I'm sorry, Junior. Just like Nidokin said, I'm an outlaw. I'm a bad guy. That... That's not true. Listen, Junior. I am an outlaw and they were searching the entire region for me. To avoid getting caught, I've just been running, running, running. And I took a break in Murky Forest. I started the rumor about Murky Forest. The rumor that a monster looked deep in the forest, in the darkness. Because of that, nobody came out there. So I thought I wouldn't get caught. That's why I took shelter in Murky Forest. I meant to tell you the truth much sooner, but I just couldn't bring myself to... I'm sorry. Master. Anyway, I am a bad guy. But, you're different. So you... You can be with me. But, haven't we had so much fun together? I thought you were going to teach me even more as we kept on exploring. If Master disappears, I'll... What will I do? Junior, did you enjoy exploring? Yeah. So, become an amazing explorer someday. For me. Don't be a blockhead like me. You've got a kid for exploring. So you should do your best to be an amazing explorer. For me. Master. It's about time. Don't go. Junior, I really enjoyed exploring with you these past few days. I knew there was a danger of being called like this, but, despite that risk, we went on explorations. And when you were with me, I had a lot of fun. This was the first time I ever really enjoyed exploring. And you are the one who has shown me how fun it can be. Thank you very much. Oh, Master, don't... I don't want you to go. Junior, try to understand. I have to answer for the things I've done. But when I finished, then if I still feel the same, I'll become an explorer. I don't know when that will be, but when that day comes, when that day comes, I'd like to go exploring with you again. It's... it's a promise. Sorry to, ha to have kept you waiting. Master! Master! Take this! Be seeing you. Master! No. <laughs> Poor Eagly Buff. <laughs> the last thing Master gave me was the thing we found on the first exploration Master and I went on. A defense globe. I see. The story of your exploration goes back all the way back to your childhood. Yes. That's why this Defend Globe is my starting point. And Gilmaster, your master. After that, what happened to him? Oh, many things happened to him, after all. He is my only master. We'll save those stories for another time. I'm too tired for more today. You know, whenever I look at this Defend Globe, I think of him. It's my starting point in becoming an explorer. And. Of course, there are lots of outlaws in this world. They are caught and punished, but... But... Truly bad Pokémon? 
don't really exist anywhere. Alright, and that's the second special chapter. Okay. <laughs> that was something. Alright. And I think this will be it for today. So let's enjoy this little music in the background in the meantime. While it goes the credits. So yeah, that is it for for today's stream. We finished the uh, Beatles chapter and we just finished Eaglepuff's chapter. Uh, after that, well, we'll continue with the special episodes. We're like halfway through. So yeah. Now tomorrow, we'll continue with Doki Doki Literature Club on Halloween. Uh, if I remember correctly, we left it just right at the uh, making the choice of who to join for preparing the festival. So we kind of left it at that choice. So we'll continue from there. But yeah, tomorrow on Halloween, do more Doki Doki Literature Club. So yeah. So that was today's stream. Tomorrow more at 4 p.m. CMT plus two time where I leave, whatever time it is where you leave. And I hope to see you guys there. So yeah. See you tomorrow. Bye bye.